It'll give Jack what I've been calling Flash. It blinds, stuns the enemy. Installed and equipped. So, how do we use it? I'll show you. Over here. Okay. Grab a weapon and get into cover. Then we'll start the test. This will do. Iris, activate Alpha 331. Certainly do. So, Say you got a target that seems awfully comfortable behind cover. Jack's flash ability fixes his back. Aim at the DB and activate. See what happens. Test sequence complete. Huh. That could be useful. Now, let's try it again with multiple targets. Iris, activate Alpha 332. Incoming, Damon. Jack's got to reroute power between flashes. Once he's recharged, hit him again. Jack Flash! Oh, two for one. Nice. Feel free to run it again if you want. Test sequence complete. No offense, JD, but, uh, Jack's my new best friend. I'm very happy for you, for both of you. But now I need you to return your weapons to the weapons locker and get out of here. Are you trying to get rid of us? Oh, you noticed. Anyway, you can boost Jack's abilities if you find the right components. Before you go see Jin, stop by the armory. They might have one you can borrow. Oh, we will definitely be doing that. Good. Now I can get back to work. What Damon means to say is that he has more important things to do. Thank you, Iris. Bluntness is one of Iris's more commendable traits. Wonder where she gets that from. So, Baird. I know you were kind of mad when Jin shoved you in here. How do you like it? Oh, I, I'm enjoying it. The workshop's quiet, peaceful. Damon is not being truthful. Shortly before you arrived, he was highly critical of the First Minister, referring to her several times as... Let's not get into specifics, Iris. Also, why did you tell him that? I detected genuine personal concern for you in Corporal Diaz's intonation. I yeah, thus judged it appropriate to inform her how you truly feel. Pooh, inappropriate sarcasm. Incompetent nurturing instincts. Iris, are you sure you're not secretly my mother? Whoa, that smells less than great. Pleased to learn I've located one of the missing sat- uh, Baird, sorry, but we should get going. No worries. Do your... thing. Come on! Hey, Foz. How's life in Jin's rear echelon treating you? Brilliant. But then we can't all be off on some... secret mission. Oh, yeah? How'd you hear about that? This is an army, not a monastery. Yeah, okay. Well, look, we'll just leave you to the very important work, punching machines. And sparring. Hang on a second, shit stick. 
Shit stick? Del, theories? I don't know. Maybe a stick made out of shit? Or, or a stick used to stir up shit. All right, fuck off. How about we make this interesting? You and me, spar right now. And how exactly is beating you interesting? Yes or no? <laughs> you want in on this? Pretty sure what's actually being measured here is gonna leave me at a distinct disadvantage. Then again, maybe not. Hilarious. Are you in or not? Oh, I'm in. Come on, man, let's just grab a jack component and get out of here. No, this will be fun. <laughs> oh, son of a... How's that fun working out for you? Try it again, Foss. Come on. Hey, here's the thing, Foss. The bottle's far with you, but not beat you. It's against their programming, but explain. Shit. False confidence. Quite a bit, actually. Want some advice, Phoenix? No, I'm good. Jin does love her golden boys. But never for very long. See, that was fun. Fuck off. All right, man. Now that Foss fun time's over. Can we go find that component? And it's not even noon yet. <laughs> ah, there's the component we're borrowing. Or stealing. I, mean, I prefer borrowing. Indefinitely. Jack, can't wait to test them out in the field. Try to contain your excitement. We still have to go to Jin's office. Yeah, Dad's probably had enough alone time with her by now. <laughs> Never could get used to the field of you and those things. enough. You gotta see someone about these headaches. I will. I promise. After we talk to Jen. Let me be perfectly clear. When it comes to this weapon, I don't share your optimism. It's the first time anyone's accused me of optimism. Yes, well, I'll remind you your wife refused the idea of bringing the hammer back online. I would have thought you'd respect Anya's wishes. I'm gonna pretend you didn't say that, for both our sakes. Anya would have wanted you, you to- You don't get to talk about her. If that's what you think, I won't argue. You and that goddamn fertility program. A program that gave you your son. And mine. 
I honor Anya. I loved Anya. I don't care if you believe me. When my program was in its infancy, she came to me. She volunteered. Both times she volunteered. Seeing First Minister Stroud undergo treatment. Do you know how many children are alive today thanks to her? She should be buried here, you know, with the All Fathers. The people need her inspiration. Your inspiration was my wife. First Minister, Lieutenant Phoenix and his squad. Send them in. Ah, Lieutenant. I'm told you had a successful mission. First Minister, I can explain. By all means, explain when Damon Baird superseded me. Explain how launching a Hammer of Dawn satellite doesn't require my explicit approval. Same page, huh? Lieutenant, the Hammer of Dawn has taken more COG lives than most of the armies we've opposed. Your father knows this as well as anyone. It's not the weapons I don't trust, First Minister. It's the people who use them. The Hammer of Dawn will not be brought back online. Ah, that'll be a report on the evacuation of Settlement 2. Settlement 2 is being evacuated? Why? There's been activity in the nearby burial site. Chief Carmine, report. Please, slow down. Mobilize the 4th Division. We'll take command of the reinforcement effort. Do it. Go. James, we're getting close. Where do you want me to take? Main gate. Keep anything else from getting inside. You realize I'm the ranking officer here, right? And we'll reinforce Carmine at the town hub. I can't believe we're back here. We did our duty. You need to get over it. Get over it? Guys, not the time. Cole, let's see what we're dealing with. Look, our raven's down. He 
Your patch is through to Carmine? Uh, no can do, kid. His radio's out. He's okay? I can see him at the central hub, so he's up and fighting, but the swarm's all over him. Hurry if you can. Run our way. Come on, Delta. Let's get out of here. farther than they hoped. Then we better move it, don't you? There's a Swarmac in the settlement. Keep your convoy away from it. Ah, oh, Delta. I was gonna do donuts around it. Be advised, Corporal. They're faster than they look. Delta out. through this building. Everybody, stay back! They're coming in! Hey! Stand down, Private! We're geared! Oh, shit, sorry, Lieutenant. No harm, no foul. What are you doing here? I uh, lost our DBs and we've got civilians holed up in here. Lizzie, Delta requesting civilian pickup. Sector 8, apartment complex. Copy that, Delta. I'll circle back. Thanks for that, Lieutenant. No problem, Private. Come on, Delta. Glad you showed up when you did, sir. Sorry again for the air and fire, Lieutenant. You guys here to pick us up? We're not, but the convoy's on the way. Careful. 
careful out there, sir. Boko. Let's go, Delta.
Hey, the street's clear, but the rooftop ain't. We got a pound, sir. Oh, grab some stuff and watch those quills. up those civvies you found. Delta, Carmine squad just got overrun. They're hunkered down with civilians inside the tower. They're not gonna last if you don't get there soon. They need you at the hub. Go! You can get there through the park. Gates by the steps. All right, you heard her. Let's move. Del. You're gonna be okay. You know, you might not have a problem with shooting innocent people, but I do. Innocent, huh? Innocent. So people frame fire bombs are innocent. Hm. Good to know. Both of you, knock it off. about this that was you three not three one of us managed to keep his dbs under control what the hell happened we identified an insurgent element and eliminated it no you opened fire on a protest every herd needs a good culling i know who i'll call from this herd Happened, happened. Right now, we focus on completing this evacuation. You're goddamn right. There's the hub. Dead ahead. Shit, Carmine is definitely in trouble. Damn it, Swarm's taking down our condors, too. Yeah, I bet that goddamn Swarm might brought it down. Every condor we lose means fewer reinforcements. through here. Shit, snatch it. That thing makes its way to the hunk. Carmine's problem is going to get a lot worse. Come on. Hey, 
Alright, Juvie! Take him out! I got one thing to say! These type of things got to go! Jack, go on, fetch. Sounds like Carmine's DB still got some fight in him. Let's go! All right, looks like Carmine's holed up in that tower with the civilians. Let's show these DBs how it's done. Clear the plaza! I got him. Shit! Everywhere! Fire in the hole! Is clear. Thanks, Delta, but you got more damn bogeys incoming. Hey, our supply drop is still out there, so put Baird's new lancers to good use. Wilco, you keep those civilians safe. We'll handle things out here. Uh oh, what do we got? Old Lancer grenade launchers? Where the hell does Baird find the time? Here, yeah, get them where they hot! Make this work. Here they come! All right, Delta, let's line them up. <laughs> Terminated. Shit, there's a lot of them! Kid, I got a couple condors left. What reinforcements do you need? 
A lot of people alive today, Sarge. Ha <laughs> ha! The grub killer retires, baby! Grub killer, swarm killer, whatever. Yeah, rescued by my old trainees. Uncle Clay! Yeah, and now I gotta get up again. Was getting worried. You didn't report back. Radio died. And these guys pulled me out of a jam. Guess I owe you twice, Phoenix. <laughs> Now walk. Let's get to the crash site! 